Good morning, and thanks for joining us. Today we're going to look at the moon. We'll discuss just what is a lunar month and also we'll talk about the dark side of the moon. It takes around 29 and a half days for the moon to complete one lunar month. This is what's known as a synodic month. This means the moon has completed a complete cycle of lunar phases. From one new moon to the next. This is different from a sidereal month where the moon makes a complete 360 degree orbit of the earth. But has not completed a full cycle of lunar phases. In other words it hasn't reached a new moon at this stage. This is because the Earth is constantly moving through space and, while the Moon orbits the planet, Earth continues to orbit the Sun, changing our position. This means the Moon has to travel that bit further in order to align itself with the Sun for its next new Moon. Did you know, there is no dark side of the moon? It is a common misconception that one side of the moon is always in darkness. In fact, all sides of the moon receive sunlight, not just the part that we see. This is because, as the moon goes through its monthly orbit around Earth, it is rotating just as our planet rotates every day. The gravitational pull of Earth has slowed the moon's rotation so much, that it seems that one side is permanently facing us. In reality, each month the moon completes one rotation, allowing sunlight to shine on all of it. In fact, when we observe a new moon from Earth, and to us it seems dark, the other side is in sunlight, equivalent to a full moon. So there is no dark side, just a far side which we can't see from our view on Earth. Thank you for joining us today on Space Videos. Please subscribe and check out our live streams.